another new foot birthday loading screen has been added and it does actually reveal to us three cards that are going to be coming this Friday so we're going to be going over them who's it actually going to be and also it does reveal to us what kind of upgrades is foot birthday going to be and how is it going to be unique to all of the other promos so just before we get into it if you are new here make sure that you do subscribe I'm gonna make lots more videos just like this one whenever a new loading screen is going to be released I'm going to be making a video breaking it down explaining it revealing which cards which players are actually going to be released in the promo going over all of the hidden clues so definitely make sure that you are subscribed so you do not miss any of those future videos so getting straight into this one now the card design has been confirmed and it is quite nice in my opinion it does look like a foot birthday cake kind of style that is what esports have gone for and with the stats on the card it does improve it a bit because there are some people that dislike it but I think when they are going to be released we are just going to all get used to it let me know down in the comments below what you guys actually thought about the card design and there is still quite a lot of talk about what exactly is going to be in foot birthday what sort of upgrades are we going to get and in my opinion I have a strong feeling it's actually going to be a squad full of players that will either have a five star weak foot or five star skill moves and some of them of course are going to have both as well so this is also supported by the five stars on the card design we can see at the top there is going to be five stars I'm assuming on all of the cards unless it is going to be maybe some sort of special one for SBCs or objectives but it should actually be on all the cards so pretty much essentially the way foot birthday is going to be unique is that when you see this foot birthday card you are going to know either it has a perfect weak foot or perfect skill moves and this is going to be the main thing in foot birthday this year in the past it was always about the position changes but now of course the shapeshifters promo did take that idea take that concept so now we are just going to see either a player that is really good on the ball and has those skills or actually can actually turn it on the other foot and still put it in the back of the net that is going to be the uniqueness of foot birthday this year and esports are clearly going for that so looking at the loading screen now on the left we do have a french 88 rated foot birthday card that is three star five star and in fifa the stars at the top are the skill moves and at the bottom they are actually the weak foot so we should be able to apply it to this and it should stay consistent and also keep in mind realistically ea are only going to actually be upgrading the weak foot or the skill moves i don't actually think they are going to give a one plus skill move and also a one plus weak foot i think it's very unlikely for esports to actually give both to one player i think it's just going to be an individual one either a skill move upgrade or a weak foot upgrade to each player so one that actually matches this requirements is actually sissoko currently he does actually have three star skill moves which are actually going to stay the same and his weak foot will actually get up upgraded to five stars in my opinion so it is most likely going to be Sissoko he matches that perfectly and it would actually be a very nice card in my opinion then the middle player is actually a 92 rated cam and with all of the Bayer Leverkusen clues from the last loading screen I think it is going to be Havertz and then on the right we do actually have a striker with 95 pace five star five star which is actually quite broad it is quite open but if you actually take into consideration the way esports are going to do it the way we have been talking about you can actually narrow it down to less players because it should actually be a striker that already has either a five star weak foot or five star skill moves and they also when they are going to be upgraded to their foot birthday card on that they should actually have 95 pace so i have actually gone for ben Yedda first of all when you look at his most recent card which is his 90 rated shapeshifters he does have 91 pace four star skills and five star weak foot but it's most likely not going to be him because he already got a shapeshifters and it is kind of conflicting with foot birthday about the position changes everything like that personally i don't actually think we are going to see position changes in foot birthday but i would still be happy to see them if esports do actually do them correctly then next of all we'd actually have hyung min son on his 90 rated in form he does actually have 91 pace so again can definitely get 95 pace on that foot birthday upgrade and he also has four star skills and five star weak foot so it would actually be upgrading those skills to make him five star five star and other than his champions league cards he hasn't actually been involved in too many promos so this would be an excellent foot birthday card if we were to see it fingers crossed it is going to be son some other possibilities also possibly 
Rashford. He does have 94 pace on his fitness card and 5 star skills and 3 star weak foot. But then again, would he only get a 1 plus pace upgrade on that foot birthday card? Most likely not. It should be a lot more. And people that completed that fitness card would be, of course, kind of left in the dark. So we are going to see. Then also Zaha, maybe. He does actually have 93 pace on his storyline. But then again, wouldn't he get more for that foot birthday upgrade? Probably at least a 3 plus or 4 plus on that pace stat and also he does actually qualify again because he does have 5 star skills and 3 star weak foot but we are going to see also fingers crossed for some nice weekly objectives so just to summarize this video quickly the player on the left should hopefully be Sissoko in the middle should be Havertz and on the right I'm going to be going for Hyung Min Son let me know down in the comments below if you agree or disagree and what you guys are hoping for with this promo thank you guys for watching this video i hope you guys enjoyed and i'll see you next time